The snackometer is used in a slow motion display to determine whether the ball did touch the bat, even slightly to determine if it was out. It is fitted in the stamp. It works on a simple principle, it filters the ambient noise, and amplify the relevant signal. The ball hitting the bat produces a sound of a particular frequency, the stump microphone picks up the sound of the ball hitting the bat. It first filters the sound which is of a particular frequency from all the ambient noise. At the receiver this sound is amplified and plotted to note the variation in the sound. A sharp variation denotes the bat hitting the ball and a flat peak means the bat has hit the pad or part of the body. The technology used for snackometer is relatively simple. It only requires a slow motion camera and good microphone. Thus the cost of the snackometer is very low making it affordable to any country. Measuring the speed of the bulb by radar is similar to measuring the speed of the moving car. This gun consists of both a receiver and a transmitter which is placed near the sight screen. The way it works is that it sends a radio wave that is reflected by any object that is in the path. In this case it is a cricket ball. The gun gets this echo and then by using the principle of Doppler shift, calculates the speed of the ball. Exact speed can be determined with help of a radar gun without any error. It is instantaneous and records the speed immediately as the ball passes the radar gun. This is the reason that in any cricket match, as soon as the bowler balls the delivery, the speed is shown on the screen. The gun works efficiently and helps getting the exact possible speed of the bowl. Everything in this universe has got heat signatures that can be seen with the help of infrared cameras. Hotspot is an infrared imaging system used in cricket to determine whether the ball has struck the batsman, bat or pad. Hotspot requires two infrared cameras on opposite sides of the ground that are continuously recording the image. Any suspected snick of the ball with a bat or any part of the batsman undergoes friction which raises the temperature of that portion a little in comparison to the surrounding. This change in temperature produces a bright spot when seen by infrared camera. The technology is used to enhance the on-field, umpire's decision-making accuracy.